Welcome back. We've escaped the hold of the ship. Yeah. Despite it being super flooded and we're gonna go find oh, more wait. treasure. I would definitely not give him all that. That is I, a fucking fortune in gold right there. That'd be half of me treasure. I don't see another entry point. Yeah, uh, could be anywhere, you know. Could it? Yeah. I mean, it couldn't. It's actually only one very specific place, but it could. Be is, is it? Is it? Is it not? Right there. Oh, uh, over here? <laughs> uh, no, it's not that one. Okay. <laughs> well, I guess I'll just go in, in this one. Give me some what? time to think about where it might could possibly be. The other side. Whoa, 69 notes. Nice. <laughs> I'm as funny as Rockstar Games. <laughs> Man, you fucking hyped for GTA 6 though, bro? Not really. What? I I just... I, I don't know. I think a, a lot of it is still... I'm just kind of done with most games. What? But you have a Let's Play show. Yeah. And... <laughs> Tell me, what uh -huh. game that have we played that actually came out within the last five years? Super Mario RPG. That actually came out within the last five years. Um, Considering that Super Mario RPG is a remake of a game from, like, 1996. Let's see. Uh, Oh, well, I mean, we didn't play Kong. Yeah, of course, that game was fucking terrible. And we didn't play WWE 2K24. True. We didn't. We played Totally Reliable Delivery Service. True. Go watch us have played Totally Reliable Delivery Service. It's really funny. There's three parts to that series. They're all very funny, I think. Uh, it was part one, Sacred and I recorded. Got 41 views. Part two, Sacred and I recorded. Got 39 views. Part three, Cran and I recorded. Got 626 views. Holy shit, what? Yeah, I think... It, I'm pretty sure it's the most popular video on the channel. It is. It's the most popular uh, video on the channel by a lot. Why? I don't know. Uh, but the second most popular video is part one of Wind Waker with 164 views. So, I mean, we did something right, apparently. Hell yeah. People just love Zelda. They well, love starting like a totally new... reliable delivery service, oh. but... And then the uh, third most popular, I'm really happy about. Uh, it's exactly 100 views is Inuyasha Part 1. Hell yeah. Because Inuyasha's actually been doing pretty good. I, I really didn't figure anybody would give even half a shit about an Inuyasha PlayStation 2 RPG in 2024. I, I want to agree with you, but something tells me that, like... That... It, it's just a part of, like, the retro nostalgia-ism. True. And, like, you know... Well, not not to mention, because, like, Inuyasha is still popular. Like, it's not particularly active, though they did get Yashihime and stuff, so, like, it's not, like, it's completely dead either. Yeah. Um, but it, it's still... Like, I, it's not, like, an S-tier anime in right. the modern day by any stretch, but it's at least a B-tier anime. Even now. Yeah. So, like... It's really the fact that it was the game. But at the same time, it's like, who's fucking played that game? Exactly. I, I'm sure there's some Let's Plays out there, but... Compared to, like, this... Probably, like, no Let's Plays. <laughs> oh, yeah. Because everybody's played Banjo-Kazooie on your show. Uh, if you're a Let's Player and you've played Banjo-Kazooie on your show, uh, leave a five-page essay in the comments about why your Let's Play is way better than our Let's Play. And while we should be ashamed for even being Let's Players. Eh. <laughs> but excuse me. No excuses. Uh-oh. Dessert! I, I could go for some dessert after my food. Me too. That I will get someday. It's almost time for Sarah to get off work. Oh, Almost. yeah, she got that new job. Yeah, she works at non-denominational hospital now. Hell, yeah. In the kitchen. I mean... Doing kitchen stuff. Job's job, you know. True. Well, it pays more and is less 
work, it sounds like. <laughs> Overall, than working at a fast food place. I bet. Especially if it's potentially the non-denominational uh, uh, hospital that I think it might be. Uh, if you're thinking of the one that's closest to us, no, it's not. It's the other one. Okay. Yeah, that one, can't go work there. That one's going to close down any day now. That's... I mean, it's probably not, actually, but... That that's one because uh, my mom is is working at, at that one, mm. taking some additional shifts just because she can. Right. Uh, and it 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 blew my mind. She sent me pictures. They still had the physical ledger uh, from when I was born because what? I was born at that hospital. I don't know what hospital I was born at. Probably but, uh, that one. But yeah, uh, she sent me some pictures of it, and I was just like, holy shit. <laughs> and then uh, that that part of the hospital is shut down, so I've outlived <laughs> where I was born. Yeah, you did. Good work, bro. Bet you never thought that day would come. Yeah. Really thought it would be quite the opposite. Yeah. Just goes to show. You should never try to predict anything because you'll always be wrong. Yeah, like that song that I like says, even the weatherman gets uh, caught in the rain sometimes. Uh-huh. Yeah. <laughs> Which song is that? Uh, it's a song called Hypotheticals. Uh. I don't remember who sings it at this exact moment. I can't jump into those, can I? Yeah, you can. I can't jump into those and expect a positive reaction, can I? Yeah, you can. Are you gaslighting me right now? No. Because if I jump in this and I get hurt... And you go, ha! Huh! Why would I have lied to you? I don't know, man. Because it's funny? Yeah. For comedic value? Oh, man. We're, it's almost like we're doing a show on the internet that relies on comedy and that maybe a little bit of misdirection... It's funny sometimes. That is but true. You're also dealing with me, and I would never let you live it down. Right, exactly. I can't do anything funny with you because I'll have to hear it 8,000 more times over the course of the rest of my hopefully long life. <laughs> yeah. Damn, bro. Fuck. You fucking whiffed it. I sure did. It's okay, it happens to the best of us. I mean, I can't remember the last time I missed a jump at Banjo Kazooie, but, you know, I'm sure it's happened. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah. All right. Good warm up. Okay. All right. Solid attempt. So I'm starting to think that I might not be able to make that one. Uh, you definitely can make it if you were to try a little harder. Fuck. <laughs> you can make that too if you try a little harder. I just want you to know, bro, I know it sounds like I don't believe in you, but I believe. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Thanks, Naruto. Believe it! Man, when are we going to watch more Ninja Bridge? I don't know. If you haven't ever seen Ninja Bridge and you want to watch Yu-Gi-Oh! The Abridged Series, Dragon Ball Z Abridged, and the like original Masako X... Uh... Vegeta 3986 or whatever his name was. Uh, Naruto the Abridged Series so that you can understand all the references. Also have seen all of like Yu-Gi-Oh 2. Um, go watch it immediately. <laughs> yeah. You know what I really want to watch more of? Huh? Uh, the Starters Show. Oh, Starter Squad! Yeah. Bro, it's fucking killer. I started watching Starter Squad when it was on episode, like, four or five or something. However many years ago it was that that was the most recent episode. Now there's ten episodes of the twelve total episodes that they say they're going to make. And when was it? Like, three months ago or something? When we watched the first time? Yeah, something like that. Uh, And we watched, like, the first eight episodes um, of Starter Squad. And it was really good, obviously. Fuck. Uh, and then 
the last time you were here, I think. Yep. We watched episode nine and episode ten, um, which is a lot of of content. Because uh, episode ten is like half as long as the first nine episodes put together, I think. Yeah. Or something like that. Yeah, it uh, is. And then episode nine is also like almost 20 minutes. It's it's like a 20 minute episode, then a 30 minute episode. So like they're getting longer and longer, which of course also means they take a while because episode 10 came out like two years ago. I think episode nine came out like four years ago. Um, so it, it's a long production cycle. It is. And we got to the end of episode 10 and Crandon was like, okay, so when's the next one? And it's like, okay, well, episode 10 came out about two years ago. <laughs> so, uh... Surely... Probably any time now? <laughs> yeah, surely... Unless it takes another year or two. I mean, we have no idea how long episode 11 is going to be. Yeah. And episode 12, so it's like... Could be, you know, maybe episode 11 comes sometime this year. Maybe episode 11 didn't come for another year or more. Maybe episode 12 is not here until, like, 2030. <laughs> Which I just, I hate to say this because it sounds bad, I'm sure, to a lot of people. But like, cause, cause that guy, he has like a million subscribers now. Uh -huh. And I, I don't know if he has a Patreon or not, but if he does, it probably brings in decent money. If he doesn't, he probably should. But it's like, surely you could make episodes faster than that. <laughs> Maybe. Which I, I hate to say, because, like, that's what everybody says about all creators. Like, you could be making episodes faster, and it's like, yeah, I could. You know, I, it's either no, I couldn't, because I'm literally putting all my time into it. Or it's, yeah, I could, but only if I stop doing literally anything I enjoy. But at the same time, it's like, at a certain point, you get big enough that you should have money coming in to pay people to make production of your show faster. Yeah. And of course, I mean, maybe they don't want to do that. Or maybe they are doing that. This is as fast as it can go. Yeah. I don't fucking know. Same. What do I look like? Some guy that makes content? Uh, yes, technically. I mean, probably. Have you seen me? I'm marketable enough to be put into WWE. God, I'm glad that didn't kill me. Yeah, you're very close to being dead. You should probably find a health box. But I don't know where one is right off the top of my head. Oh, Banjo and Kazooie look so sad. Uh, yeah, it's because they're dying. Ah, uh, they'll be all right. Most people don't like that. Listen, rub some dirt in it. You'll be fine. <laughs> yeah, rub some dirt in it. That way you can get an infection and die. Oh, I mean, that, that, that's what all the old people told, told us. Yeah, and you know what the thing about old people is? What? They're dumb. Yeah, but they have, they've also lived for like 80 years. Yeah. So, to some degree, the right. That survivorship bias. <laughs> yeah? Oh, no. Careful, bro. Oh, I see. I can just. Yeah, but That's if you do it from to too high, you'll die. Seriously? Yeah, because you've got... You'll take fall damage if you do it too high, and you have one HP. But I'm doing a move. Yeah? That's a move that's gonna kill you if you're not silly. careful. That's so silly. I'm just saying, bro. Ah, huh. you'll never find him now. He's completely hidden. Is he? Yeah, he's impossible to find. Aw, oh, shit. Uh-huh. <laughs> Don't look over there! Water damage? Do I take fall damage in water? No. But okay. there is a shark in there, so you don't want to be in there for very long. Nice. Oh god, a boss fight! He's not actually. He's just a treasure chest. Open him gently, he said. Jesus Christ! Oh, well, I hit the I hit the regular attack button and it didn't do shit. So yeah, no, I I, I'm, I don't think there's any other way. Oh, the free health! Yeah. Thank the Lordy, Lordy, Hallelujah, Amen. 
There we go. That's all I needed. <laughs> but just in case, I guess I grab these two just because it makes my health bar look nicer. And no other reason. Yeah, got him. Yeah. Okay. So I've got all the the boys. Yes, I guess. Uh, I want that. I want that real bad. Yeah. Bad enough to die? Maybe. Well, that doesn't sound like a very good idea. Eh. Oh, get out of there! Jump out of the water! No, not under the water! I, I am, I am desperate. What no! are you doing? I keep the camera changes, and so it's it's hard. No, bro, you're gonna fucking die. <laughs> yeah, I am. Okay, now don't do anything. All right. So you're gonna want to go straight back to land. Yeah. And when you go, don't go underwater. Just jump on the surface of the water and flap away as quickly as possible. All right, so you need health again. Yeah. And once again, I don't know where another thing is. Oh, actually, maybe I do. I'll go back the other way. Yeah, just follow this until we get back to the starting area. I probably already broke it and take, took it because I just mindlessly collect things. Maybe. Uh, other way. Yeah, keep going this way. Uh -huh. Watch out for enemies. Nope. <laughs> If that guy that I thought was around here is actually a thing that exists, you've already broken him. Is this a boss battle? Uh, that is a boss battle, yes. So not, uh, not exactly gonna just jump into that one. Hmm. This is a real conundrum now. Yeah. Oh, thank the Lord! I knew I left this one alive <laughs> for a good reason. Hell yeah, we're saved! Alright, what what all stuff do you still have left? You need six more notes. Some number of jiggies. Well, no, I've got all the... Oh, no, never mind. I thought you were talking about the boys. Jinjos? Yeah. No. Jinjo Minjos! Nah, Minjos are somebody else. Ginger Minjo. No, Minjos are somebody else. Ginger Minjo is how I refer to gingivitis. Ah. Now, I think I saw somewhere over here there was a tiny little platform that may have had... Yeah. Is that one down there? Uh, that is a platform down there. Yeah. So you're not actually supposed to get to this area from up there. Uh-huh. When you... At that place where those ladders were, this is off to the side of that. Oh. Well, I got another Jiggy. Hell yeah. And we'll probably get even more Jiggies next, next time. time on the show gaming.